Video Creator Review. Hi, Adam Payne here with the Video Marketing Insider. And in today's video, we're gonna be looking at a new software called Video Creator. That's not the most imaginative name I know. We'll walk through what it claims to do, and then we'll have a look inside the members area and go through it and see how good or bad it is. And as always, I'll be as upfront as I can. This is not a video to say that it's the best thing in the world, and it's also not a video to say it's terrible. We'll find out as we go. Personally, I'm a little bit over all of these products that come out. There's so many of them, and they're either crap, they don't work as they claim, or they've got really good ideas, but they're just not needed. And very, very rarely these days does something come out that I think is actually any good. So we'll see if this is any good. So we're right now we're over at the JV page, and this is what it tells us it is. It's um, It allows you to build world-class animated videos for any marketing goal in all shapes, topics and languages in 60 seconds or less. So as always, these things make really bold claims. I will be very surprised if this is true. We'll find out in a second. Nice little graphic here. And it basically just, on this page, I'm not gonna go through it, but basically you can see here, look, 650 templates, and you can build videos for a variety of different things. E-commerce, ads, whiteboard videos, explainer videos, product promos, slideshows, pretty much everything. So some pretty big claims. Now it's by Paul Ponner and Sid Diwa, who you probably know if you've seen this stuff before. And to their credit, they do generally make good stuff and they do support their things long term. So I'll give them that. They've been around for a long time. They're very experienced. So you know they're not just going to disappear. Now, I wasn't particularly impressed with their previous launch, but the ones before that I liked. So, you know, it's been a bit of a mixed match for me, but we'll see how it goes. Now, most people promote like reviewing this, they're not gonna review it, they're just gonna tell you it's really, really good. Um, now this product, if we go to the pricing, it's gonna cost you between 47 and $67 to get this app. And then you're gonna be presented with four optional upgrades, which is a little bit too much for my liking. You're gonna get the deluxe package, the unlimited package, the voice suite unlimited and then another you know it's way too much stuff for me but we're going to focus more on the main offer so um i actually got well they actually spoke to me on skype they messaged me on skype and said would i be interested to check this out and they gave me a review copy because i wasn't actually going to bother to be perfectly honest but I do know that there are going to be tons of people promoting this. There's $30,000 in prizes. And again, you know, when there's big money involved and the promise of these guys reciprocating for somebody else's launch, everybody's ethics goes out the window and they'll promote anything. So anyway, I, got, I logged in. This is my review copy. And the first thing I thought was like, wow, it's pretty empty. Now, granted, it might change, but it's launching tomorrow. Um, so there's nothing in here. I thought, well, this isn't much use is it so if I click on this little question mark it opens up in a new tab to their support desk but it's just you know a thank you message and an email to connect with support and so well there's not much there so maybe I've got to just you know play around with this so let's click on create video so um, when you log in, you're kind of presented with this. It's four steps. So I very much doubt you're going to get through all this in 60 seconds. Maybe in theory it's doable, but it's not really likely, to be honest. So we can choose our video type. We then choose from one of their templates. We personalize the video, and then we preview and process. So let's click on choose video type. And if we scroll down, you can see here, down here, we've got all the different templates. Um, ads, e-commerce, fashion and style, live action, neon signs, motion tracking videos. Now that was one of their big selling points on the sales page. So motion tracking videos basically means you can put your logo and it kind of moves around the video as opposed to being a static logo in the top corner like a watermark. So we've got these, we've got basically one, uh, six templates there. So if you don't like what you see here, you can't really use it. Let's go to video flipbooks. We've got three templates there. Um, product demos. Um, for, we've got quite a few in there, but they're all, look, all these are basically supplement stuff. I'm not in the supplements. So let's come down, load more. And if we click on load more, I guess they just go on forever until we kind of run out of the ones they've got so let's just choose something random let's choose well let's choose the um, motion tracking videos because I'd be quite interested to see how this works um, again I'm not in I've not got a loan company I'm not into shopping bags or 
this one's oh there it is soda can mock-up so again if you're not really into this stuff it's a little bit tricky to use it but um, let's click on the soda can one anyway okay so we can click on this and let's just watch it it's going to play up and load up in youtube we'll click on use this template now there are softwares out there such as videos that focus primarily on these kind of videos but anyway so we've got the different screens um, the audio is there by default can we change the audio let's click on that no okay so I'm not quite sure okay never mind uh, oh audio okay image we need an image so we've got to upload an image we can have a JPEG or a PNG apparently and that's the minimum recommended size so I don't have one of that size but let me um, upload an image I'll click on logo I can go to Pixabay Pexels um, not sure that I'm gonna upload an I'm gonna upload a logo. I'm gonna click on upload, and I've got to find a logo from my computer. So let me just uh, pause this video while I search for a logo. Okay, so I've got my logo here. This one I'm gonna use this logo. I'll open it up. I've got no idea if it's the right size or not, but that's a logo for my video PLR brand. So we like this. So I guess we're gonna hit next or proceed. I don't know. So soda name. Well, let's change this to my brand. Video content content PLR uh, text one I'll put done for you videos text two done for you articles there's a lot more than that but I don't have enough space for that so um, video let's put it in caps video content uh, PLR.com okay so we've got that now can we go to next to the color? Let's just go back, did it save it? It did save it, so let's choose the color. Well, my brand's blue, so we'll choose that as a color. And then we'll hit proceed. Um, this video will be processed and successfully created when you will click on proceed button. Well, let's go back to personalized video. Um, image it was still there, text is still there. Can I preview this? Let's click on preview and see what happens. So it started to load up. Um, it's taken a little bit of time, as you can see. And when people buy this, because this is going to sell like hotcakes, because again, tons of people are going to promote it. The majority, the majority of people that buy this stuff won't actually know how to use it. And when I mean how to use it, they won't know how to use it for their own marketing stuff. They'll just be buying a, a new toy. And it's going to just be a lot slower because there's going to be tons and tons of stuff going at the same time. It's going to put a lot of pressure on their server. So it's a little bit worrying that it's this slow right now. And of course, you don't want to wait for this to whirl around. So let me pause the video and I'll come back in a sec. Well, I'm back and I'm tired of waiting. So I'm going to close this off. I'm going to hit proceed and we're going to go ahead and render this video. I don't need an email, so I'm just going to hit proceed. And there we have a video rendering. Now, I've not got time to wait for this to render, so hopefully I'll show you a few other things, and then we can kind of come back and see if this is done. So let's go back to create video. And you can see up here there's something called aspect ratio. Now, this is really important if you want to put videos on different social media. For YouTube, it's generally landscape, 16 by 9. Um, it's usually an aspect ratio of 1 to 1, which means a square video if you want to put it on somewhere like Facebook or Twitter. You can have square videos on other platforms. Vertical videos are great for Instagram and Pinterest. So let's click on this. So let's click on vertical. Um, we've got some vertical templates here. Now again, if you've got a particular local business or you do stuff in the local marketing niche, you may be able to pick and choose a bunch of these different templates. Um, but personally, I I just use Vidnami. And Vidnami, although it doesn't have as many templates as this, it's just been around for a long time. They're constantly improving it. And my first impression when I looked into Video Creator was like, well, I've got Vidnami. Vidnami is slicker, smoother, supported. They're not doing launches all the time. They're not hitting you up with affiliate promos. So if I were you, I'd probably go with Vidnami. But again, this might this does have a few other features that Vidnami doesn't have. Let's click on um, let's click on quick preview. Use this template. Um, what have we got here? So we've got some. We need to add some media. So what kind of media can we add? Text, I guess. Well, let's put text in here. New video swipe up. Okay. Check out video market. This is another one of my brands. Marketing Insider. Uh, swipe up that's okay so we'll come back there we'll add 
another logo for this. So we're going to play around with this. And again, I'll pause the video while I find my logo. Okay, so I've got my logo here for my video marketing insider brand. So we'll open that up. Well, that didn't seem to work, did it? Did that work? Media? No media found. Well, it didn't do it, did it? So let's try that again. Not much point me pausing the video, was there really? Well, we'll try and pause that again. Well, for some reason, every time I try and upload my video, it, upload my logo, it jumps back to this, so I can't basically use that. Let's go to my videos anyway and see if the other video is still rendering. It's only been 11%, since it's going to take a long time to render. It's a tiny video, and if you've got you know thousands of users at the same time, it's going to be a bit iffy, isn't it? So um, I don't really want to go through and show you how to make another video, because I think you get the idea. You choose a type of video, you choose a template, you personalize it, and you preview it. Um, so again, I didn't really see here. I might be wrong, I might have missed stuff. Let's choose a template. I didn't see where to do the language stuff. Um, popularity, so we can filter these by date, title, and length. Um, what other kinds of stuff we got down here? We've got a bunch of different stuff. Uh, neon signs, what's neon signs? It's a neon sign, surprisingly. Um, yeah, don't really know what else to say to be honest in this review. I mean, I know the guys behind this support their stuff, but when I went to their sales page and their JV page, the claims that this is some amazing new video creator that's going to change the landscape and it's got all these brilliant features, I don't see it personally. Now, I'm going to leave my link below because you know, sometimes I'll make these videos and I'll say things aren't that great. And people are still buy it so you know what well, if people still want to buy it there will be a link below but it's not something that I can get behind and put my name behind and all of that stuff because I just don't see why really I mean you know I don't see how this is different to anything that's been released before I mean yeah they may have different um, templates and they may have bunches of different you know stuff down here but you know the whole process choose a template edit it and publish it this has been done a gazillion times and even if this does stand the test of time and they do improve and support it, I just I just don't get it. Um, Vidnami is a million times better and that's what I use and that's what I'm going to use and I've seen nothing reviewing this that will change my mind. Let's go back to my videos. It was 11% before. Now we're now up to 27%. I'm actually going to pause this video and I'll show you, I will show you the finished article because that's only fair in a review and if you've actually carried on watching the video for this long. I don't know how long this is going to take but I'll see you in a sec. Okay, so it's been 25 minutes, 84%. I am losing the will to live. But I'm going to stick through it. I'll see you in a few percentiles time. Finally, half an hour later, we have the video here. Now, I'll play it in a second. But what I will say this, half an hour is just not acceptable. That being said, if they leave the rendering times as it is, they're going to get a load of abuse. So I'm pretty sure they're going to have to you know, fix the issue that I faced so probably you won't see rendering times like that I'm guessing but of course I don't know for sure um, but then of course on the other side when a ton of people do something at the same time it does cause issues the thing is I do trust these guys to stand by their stuff and fix it so you do have that but anyway let's go and look at the video I've got no idea if it's gonna be any good or not let's hit play Well, there's no text. Oh, there it is. Where's the logo? Um, let me just make this big screen. Logo, anybody? I put a logo on there. You saw me upload it. We got that. We got that. Is it going to appear now? Right. So let's get rid of that. So there you have it. The logo didn't even appear. So. I don't get it. I mean, I know people are going to say this is brilliant. I know people are going to promote it. I've already explained the reasons why. I've not got a problem with the guys that have made this, but for me, it's just a gimmick that isn't going to pretty much help anybody. They've Obviously, maybe I missed something. Maybe I did something wrong. Maybe I should have just changed a setting somewhere, but I didn't see that. So there's no way I can you know, advocate this and say you should get it, blah, blah, blah. You're much better off served by getting a tool such as Vidnami or, you know, a different video creation tool if you want one. If you just want to get the um, intros and outros and, you know, logo stingers, just get videos because that's what that does. And if you want to create videos for, you know, um, TikTok or Instagram or you want to get the square videos, then I would just get Vidnami because it just it's just longer term and it's better. 
there's not really much more I can say. Any questions, let me know below. Other than that, thank you for watching. I hope you appreciated that I took you through it and that I was giving you my honest opinion. Please give me a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, hit the bell notification, and I'll see you later on. Cheers. Thank you for watching. If you've got any questions or you need more clarification, go and watch the video once more. Over on the right-hand side, we have some more trainings and reviews, so go and watch those as well. Please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you've not done so already, and hit the bell notification. Other than that, ask any questions you've got below, and I'll see you soon.